Hello Kurt, this is your brake booster on the uh, test stand. Okay, there's the test stand. All right, what we're gonna do is we're gonna test your booster and we've got um, two sets of vacuum gauges. And this is going to uh, tell us how the vacuum uh, diaphragm is working internally. That's the one I had to replace because your old one was shot. <clears throat> and what we're looking for, our expected values, if we want this uh, needle to go up to about 18 or 20 inches of vacuum. Same with this one. But then when we activate the booster, uh, this will drop to zero. And then we, at the same time, <clears throat> we're going to be working with these gauges here. They're hydraulic. Uh, we got input gauges on this side. This gauge is going to go all the way up to the top, the 50, and then this gauge is going to continue on and go up to our maximum input. And then our output side, <clears throat> now this gauge is going to go up uh, to its maximum, then the next gauge takes over and goes up to our final output uh, pressure. And we're going to test that right now. And I use this handle here as it's uh, attached to a master cylinder inside, and that's where, where the brake fluid comes from. Activate. Okay, we've activated your booster. show you the, uh, how the gauges work. There's our maximum pressure. And we come back here and we check the booster. Checking it for leaks, no leaks. Holding back in. What we have is a very, very nice booster. nice booster.